The delivery date for the Cybertruck is fast approaching, and the mesmerizing footage of the vehicle is making its way across various social media platforms, with a notable presence on X. At this stage, our anticipation revolves around the eagerly awaited tweet from Tesla and Elon Musk, where they will unveil the official release date of the Cybertruck. This has created an atmosphere charged with excitement and eager anticipation. Just a few hours ago, Jeff Roberts shared an image featuring four Cybertrucks arriving at Giga Texas on Labor Day. This image serves as yet another piece of evidence that the official launch date for the Cybertruck is drawing nearer with each passing day. On a separate note, we would like to convey our best wishes and profound gratitude to all the dedicated employees who contribute to Tesla. May you all be blessed abundantly. Earlier, Joe Tetmeyer's fly camera also captured a scene featuring four Cybertrucks cloaked in protective fabric at the Texas factory. As with previous instances, our speculation is that these may be the vehicles designated for final testing or possibly intended as display items for the forthcoming September event. What are your thoughts on this matter? Additionally, what updates can we expect for the Cybertruck? Tesla has a track record of impressing us with the towing capabilities of their vehicles, such as the Model X, which can tow a boxable folding house, something that's quite remarkable for a crossover SUV. Now, the Cybertruck is further asserting its strength as it was spotted towing a large trailer, raising hopes that it will serve as a capable work truck. While electric pickup trucks in general have yet to prove themselves as effective work vehicles, Tesla aims to change that with the Cybertruck. From the early stages of the vehicle's development, Tesla CEO Elon Musk emphasized his vision for it to drive better than a sports car while being more practical than a Ford F-150. A crucial aspect of achieving this is a robust towing capacity. Initially, when unveiling the Cybertruck, Tesla mentioned a towing capability of over 14,000 pounds, but that was four years ago, and the specifications were expected to be updated for the production version. Recently, a Cybertruck prototype was seen towing a substantial trailer on public roads. Considering that Tesla is gearing up to launch the production version of the electric pickup truck, this sighting might indicate testing of the Cybertruck's towing capacity. The trailer being towed appears to be approximately 24 feet in length, which likely means it weighs over 5,000 pounds when empty. Of primary interest to potential buyers will be the vehicle's efficiency while towing. Electric vehicles have limited range, depending on the battery pack size, and any loss in range due to towing is significant. Tesla has been a leader in electric vehicle efficiency, but even they must contend with the laws of physics. Loss during towing is inevitable, Tesla enthusiasts hope for a usable range of over 200 miles when carrying a substantial load. Moving on to the changes in the Cybertruck's interior, the short clip was shared by the Cybertruck Owners Club which was fortunate enough to receive some behind-the-scenes video of what seems to be an upcoming advertisement for the all-electric pickup truck. The Cybertruck was off-roading when the clip was taken, and one person could be seen holding a gimbal setup. As could be seen in the clip, a rear display has been installed on the back of the center console. The rear display is similar to those that have been equipped on the Model S, Model X, and now the Model 3 Highland. With the Cybertruck also having a rear display, the Model Y would be the only vehicle in Tesla's lineup that would not have a rear display. Such a feature would likely make it to the Model Y once the vehicle receives an upgrade like the Model 3 Highland. The recently shared clip also hinted that the space in the rear of the Cybertruck could be a bit tight with several adults sitting side by side. However, since full gimbal setups like the ones being used inside the vehicle at the time the video was taken are not small at all. One understandable gripe from EV watchers, however, was the fact that the Cybertruck in the video had more standard Tesla seats, not the sharp, angular seats that were fitted on the original Cybertruck prototype from late 2019. The original prototype featured seats that followed the vehicle's minimalist and angular design. This is Tesla we're talking about, however, and CEO Elon Musk has maintained that the company always makes it a point to release a production vehicle that's better than its concept version. The Cybertruck has been dubbed by Musk as Tesla's potential magnum opus, so it would be quite surprising if the company releases the vehicle with rear seats that are worse than its original prototype. This recent discovery suggests that the only new Tesla model lacking a rear infotainment screen will be the Cybertruck, at least until it receives a refresh. The Model 3 received a rear screen with its recent facelift, while the Model S and Model X gained this feature during their 2020 refresh. The last part of today, let's talk about Cybertruck's headlights. One of the reasons why the original Tesla Cybertruck prototype was so unique apart from its polarizing looks was its lights. 
The Tesla Cybertruck's headlights, which come in the form of a large, bright strip that spans the front of the vehicle, are definitely eye-catching. Completing this was another light bar installed on top of the windshield. Together with bright fog lamps, the two light bars on the Cybertruck's front end gave the vehicle an extremely futuristic feel. Since its unveiling, the Cybertruck has seen its own fair share of changes. These included the apparent removal of the middle seat in front and changes to the material used in the Volt's motorized tonneau cover. As per a recent nighttime sighting of the vehicle, the Cybertruck also appears to have lost the light bar on top of its windshield, which was shared on the r Tesla Motors subreddit, featured a wrapped Tesla Cybertruck unit at a supercharger. The vehicle seems to be the same unit that was spotted, sporting a humorous and very green Toyota Tundra wrap. Or clip. The Cybertruck promptly left the supercharger station when another vehicle pulled in. Considering the time of the sighting, as well as the fact that the Cybertruck's front headlights and fog lights were engaged, one could assume that the vehicle's lights were fully engaged. Despite this, it was evident that there was no light on top of the Cybertruck's windshield. Fortunately, the Cybertruck's front lights, even without its windshield light bar, still seem enough to provide ample visibility at night to the driver. A pretty cool change to the headlights, and its rear lights are also a bit different. Cybertruck was spotted with its full-width rear light bar fully illuminated while driving during the night as shown in a recent video published on X by the user at Alopnicle. Embedded below, the one and a half minute long sighting reveals how the soon-to-be-delivered all-electric pickup's taillights will work, and it's a rather interesting way of doing things. When driving with the lights on, the whole light bar is illuminated evenly, but when the driver hits the brakes, the intensity of the two outer brake lights increases and the center of the light bar makes way for the third brake light, shutting off the surrounding LEDs. With the brakes on, the rear lights look the same as in a previous Cybertruck sighting, where the EV was driving during the day, but this new video might be the first one that shows the light bar illuminated in its entirety on a production intent unit. Back in February, after Tesla enthusiasts complained online about the lack of a rear light bar on the Cybertruck, the company's CEO, Elon Musk, replied on X and said that the production version of the Zero Emissions pickup will indeed have a red light bar. Now, with this latest sighting, Musk's comment from six months ago holds true. What do you think about Cybertruck's changes? Leave us a comment below. And that's the end of today's episode. We sincerely thank you for watching today's video and for all of your support of our channel, Techstar. As always, if you enjoyed our video, please leave a like, share the video, subscribe to the channel, and ring that bell to stay up to date on exciting developments in the world of EVs. We hope to see you again next time. Until then, take care and be safe.